everybody, and welcome back to my channel. So today, what I wanted to let you see, and I and I'm sorry that it is a very, very, very short video, but today I thought that because I am working on a children's book, I'm actually working on a couple of children's books that I have written myself. Uh, this is the first illustration that I chose to draw for this book. It does not have a name yet. The general premise of it is there is a young cat and his grandfather, he is very, very grumpy and he never smiles, laughs, plays, you know, stuff like that. And he goes through his life, which is an extraordinary life on why he never, you know, laughs or smiles or plays or does these other things. You know, and why he seems to be always grumpy. He's really not grumpy, he just seems to be because he just doesn't do these things. And in this illustration, I am explaining that, uh, you know, Grandpa Cat has, you know, was a world-renowned boxer, and he never smiles because he went against this kangaroo and, you know, lost his teeth. And so he no longer smiles because of that. And this was the starting point for my book. I thought that if I could get this drawing down and, you know, set the character... I've already done character designs uh, for Grandpa, the small cat, mom, cat, stuff like that. And, you know, all of the other little tiny things that are going to be characters within the story. I have already designed those. It was just, I wanted to get the feel for the book. And so this first illustration was giving me that feel. What kind of tone, what kind of colors, uh, what kind of, you know, pace do I want to set for this book? Now, this illustration did take me quite a while to do. I did do it on my Twitch channel, and I believe that in the in my description, I do have my Twitch. I, I rarely use Twitch, but every once in a while, I will stream, you know, a live illustration of a book. And, you know, nobody really watches, but <laughs> it's not really for other people. It's really just for me. So it doesn't really bother me that nobody really watches. But yeah, so it did take me quite a while because I was live streaming this and, you know, there were a couple of people that were asking me questions and, you know, I had to take breaks because, you know, my son woke up and so it did take me quite a little bit to actually do this. I believe that the total time was around about four hours. And, you know, for a simple illustration such as this, I don't, I, I'm not too sure about other artists, if it would take them about four hours to do, but it definitely took me about four hours to do, because I kept on, you know, stopping, looking at it, wanting to change things, you know, I saw that the mouth wasn't giving me that effect of being punched, and so I had to go and redo that, and, you know, wanted, was debating on whether or not I wanted to have a black eye, or what, because I just didn't want it to be too violent, but I wanted it to be, you know, still kind of, not violent and gory, but, you know, still have that effect of, he's been in a long match, and, and this, you know, just goes to show that, you know, he's been in this long match, he's weary, he's tired, you know, he's, the, the kangaroo has a black eye, so I really do hope that you have enjoyed this, and I am sorry that it is quite short, but if you do like it, please let me know. I will upload more of the illustrations for my children's books, you know, give it kind of some context to it, and you can kind of follow me along with this story. So please tell me what you think. Thank you very much for watching. And yes, I will say that I do accentuate, you know, the eccentricities of these people, you know, but that's, that's what art is all about. Is that you